What's it, Cannon Lads? Marshall here. Welcome back to another review on the channel. Now, tonight, in terms of content, we really didn't get much. Especially captains wise, we got no hero captains, no foot captains. And this is when it does come down to the SBCs. We did get like on moments, and I'm looking at this card thinking, hey, this is pretty decent. Robin Van Persie, icon moments. He looks brilliant. And I'm going to tell you straight away, he performs brilliant as well. But the thing is, his SBC is 100,000 coins plus, more than he is on the market. What's going on, man? What is going on around here? I, 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 I just, je ne comprends pas, you know what I mean? I, I have no idea what's going on anymore. But I'm going to give you my opinions on Robin Van Persie, just in case you want to grab him off the market or you want to use your fodder in order to get a Robin Van Persie. Simple as. I'm going to give you the low down or the high down. No, low down, high up, or the high up stood out. See, I threw it around, dude. I threw it around. But on Robin Van Persie, he's got four star, four star, high low work. It's six foot two and left foot primarily. Guys, if you do enjoy this review, please make sure to leave a like on it. Comments, get amongst the comments. I think I uploaded last night the brand new SBC. Sometimes it's very demoralizing, and I, dude, it's not just on you. Maybe I'm not doing good enough as a video uh, creator or anything like that. I had like uh, two comments, which by the way, massively grateful for. It just felt like um, people weren't watching it or needing it or just interested, to be honest. So uh, guys, get amongst the comments. Thoughts on Van Persie and thoughts on what you want to see on the channel. Uh, as for the card, engine and game style. 89 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. I've used engine simply because his agility, I mean, it's very good, but the balance is terrible. So I need to boost that. And um, yeah, the byproduct of that is great. Uh, pace, which he did have anyways, 89, 87, it's not too shabby, but of course the 94, and uh, if my mass is correct, 92, pretty smart me, uh, shooting wise, 96 in second position with the high low workers as well, it gets into so many good positions to score goals, 95 finishing, 95 shot power, 92 long shots, 97 volleys, and 95 penalties, give him one of the best shooting categories, um, on the entirety of the game, simple as that, passing wise, very creative is Robin Van Persie, so I know he's a striker, you don't actually have to play him in that position. You could rock him as a cam, and he could play it sensationally well from there. Especially with overlapping your striker. If you've got like stay forward on your striker, and then you've got stay forward on your cam, what Van Persie would do in that role is sometimes overlap. If you hold the ball up with your striker, make the running behind the defense from deep as well. Meaning, it's going to be very hard to mark him. So if you take that through ball right, Van Persie's for own goal, and with how clinical his stats are, and how clinical he is in game, it's a very, very nice. Of course, he does have 92 dribbling, despite the 81 balance. Traits are sensational, mate. Outside of foot shot, power header, flare. Mission one, finesse shot would have been magnificent. As for the icon profile, you guys can see here, Fane already started, Fane already ended. I love seeing journeys like that in football. You finish where you start. You start where you finish. I, I don't know, it's just nice. It's like a... Uh, a fairy tale plus over a hundred caps in Netherlands. Um, I do believe a lot of people said like Van Persie always like didn't perform for the Netherlands. That's one every like two games for an international record for like a lot of top tier or just even players in general. That's actually not too too bad. Uh, Arsenal, great there, sensational there. Went to, went to Manchester United as well. Sensational there. Honestly, Van Persie, absolute leander of a player. Guys, what we're going to do now is get in the gameplay, see how much of a leander he is on FIFA 22. So here we go, here we go, Satellite Radio. Van Persie, review. Doesn't rhyme. But straight away, I knew this guy was special. This is one of his first efforts, man. Chest, I mean, I, I, oh, if I'd gone in, I'm jumping out my window and I'm on uh, the second floor. So it might have hurt me ankles. But given the size of me, I probably would have died. But that was a sensational effort of Robin Van Persie. Uh, it wasn't even on his chest like I did see. It was with his right foot, shot with his left foot. It was pure poetry. That's what he can offer you. Straight away, I thought, you know what? This guy has the talent. He's got the left foot, he's got the dribble in. And he just looks absolutely magnificent. Look at this, by the way. Creating the angle. I went for the Rabona shot. I probably shouldn't have done that. Great save by the goalkeeper. But what you're already seeing, and what he's all already showcasing is incredible technical ability, whether it be with the ball his feet. It's insane. Dribbling-wise, it is perfection. Literally perfection. He's very responsive, very evasive in his dribbling, and uh, it always seems to be under control. 
But not all, like not just that. He's also technical brilliance is with his first touch. It could be with a dribble here, there, everywhere. But if that first touch is like perfection, GG's. You've got a player on your hands. Plus, the first time strikes. Very good with Robin Van Persie. But um, yeah, I believe this is his first goal. His first goal actually came from the penalty spot. We won a penalty. We dispatched the penalty. Uh, very accurate with the pen. I mean, he's got 95 penalties. So, uh, yeah, I could have put it the left side originally, like you did see, I finished it the left side too, but I could have dragged it to the right-hand side without his reticle moving too, too much. That goal is blooming gorgeous, mate, if I do say so myself. Um, a volley over the top of the keeper, which was just a pure volley from me, but it also looked like a chip at the same time. But uh, it was a very good finish, man. We flick it up here, we flick it over his shoulder, we have a terrible effort. But um, does he score this one in the end? I actually think he, he does. Oh, he does, man. That one there, I actually wanted to see a replay, so I let it run. Because it almost fe uh, felt, anyways, or seemed. Um, I saw the ball went through his body, and he just did a 360 spin. Bang, left foot. Instead of just taking on his right foot or something like that. Which I've got no problem with, as long as the ball ends up in the back of the net. Um, what's he like in like a deeper role? See if like, I got the ball there with Van Persie, and then just did like held it up. He's very good. He can be very creative. Four footed as well. Gotta remember, he's got a four star weak foot. Um, a lot of people thought he could be like one footed. Robin Van Persie, left foot is where the majority of goals came from. But um, it's fantastic what this guy has to offer on the pitch, man. He's just sensational. Bicycle kick there. Um, I did kind of cater towards Van Persie on that clip, but I wanted to see how good he was in the air. It was like a header wise. But uh, the chip from Jao Felix with the scoop. It didn't go far enough for him to head us, so I pressed left trigger, initiated the overhead kick, and uh, the rest is history. Literally, because it happened in the past. And that one hit the post there. Uh, dude, I was so impressed by his technique. And I keep coming back to it as well. Everything he seemed to do, that was offside, uh, was perfect. Literally perfect. So, he has got one thing right. This card. It's brilliant. It's a brilliant card. Look at that for a chip. That is gorgeous, mate. If I do say it more so myself, that is a masterpiece. I did like a step over and he chipped it with his other foot. His right foot, man. Masterpiece. Gorgeous. Simply exhilarating. So EA has got the card right. It's fantastic. But EA has not got the price of this SBC right. Simply shocking, to be honest. Lads, let's get into the summary. Now, don't get me wrong. There's always going to be a debate. SBC versus the transferable version. But I don't think there should be such a difference in price. Honestly, I, I don't believe this should. Now, the price that you're seeing in the left-hand corner of your screen right now, that's actually, and I'll just bring it up for myself, uh, that's his transfer price. Transfer price. So that's him on the market, right? If I refresh this now, it's actually went up a little bit. 420, 460. What? He's got about 40k on his console right now. But then you look at the SBC price. It is 480 right now, minimum, on PlayStation, and 490 on Xbox. And that is still more than his transferable version. I, I, I don't get the discrepancy between the prices, man. Now, it's not like a large discrepancy right now, anyways. It was uh, initially when I did the graphics. Um, but still, I, I get that people have fodder. I get that people want to put fodder in over time. Hey, I do too. I want to put fodder in uh, over time, my unneeded fodder for SBCs. I, I don't, don't get that wrong. But I still don't believe the SBC should be more than the transferable version because the SBC, you've got to take into consideration, is untradeable. It is untradeable. I mean, you're not going to get those coins back. Whereas the transfer version, if you get him, you don't like him after 25 games, sell him on. Fair news, you might make a loss, but you can still get rid of it and make some coins back. With the SBC, simply not possible. Now, that, what I will say with that, the try before you buy. Uh, you see me with the loan version right here, five games. Do it. I'm, I'm just saying it. Do it, man. Because if you've got, like, reservations about Van Persie, you're like, oh, will he fit my team? Will he do this? Will he do that? You get a taste of it with the loan version. Just that much. Five games. It gives you a taste of what potentially you could have in your team. And if that's what you like, then go for it. Don't submit everything straight away, straight in the SPC. Try before you buy. The loan's there, not for a reason, but it does serve a purpose. You know what I mean? It gives you a chance 
to not submit anything for a card that you potentially won't like. Uh, I, I believe it's like minimum silver, but like some gold, and I think it's like Serie A or something like that. So it's very, well, is this Serie A? I used a Serie A, I believe. No, I used, I didn't even use a Serie A. I used Eredivisie, I think it needs one Dutch player. So I used the Eredivisie, it was, it was very simple, man. Very simple and very cheap too. I can actually give you the price of the loan version. So it is try before you buy, and uh, the loan version, it's under 10k, mate, 8,000 coins. Uh, I know you only get five games, but those five games could potentially save you some spending not only tens of thousands, but hundreds of thousands on your SPC. Overall rating for Robin Van Persie, this guy oozes, he oozes with quality. I don't know why I did that elongated ooh. I kind of like it, to be honest. 9.5 is what he will get from myself. Absolute baller on the game. Technicals, technicals, technicals. He's a technically excellent so uh, football player. I was going to say soccer, boys. Where did that come from? I'm watching too much soccer here and soccer Saturday. But um, yeah, fantastic player in this game. Enjoyment. Everyone loves enjoyable players. Four star, four star. Great dribbler. Great pace. Great finishing. Great movements. Four star combo. Very enjoyable cards. 9.4 for myself. Um, yeah, he, br he brings um, a lot to your second place. Because not only does he have the finishing and clinicalness of a striker, he's always got like the creativity of like a cam or a playmaker within the team. So it's like a, a best of both worlds situation. Uh, price. Now this is going simply off the 390 to 420, which as you guys know by now, 420 is kind of the minimum right now on PlayStation 4, 70. But I mean, these prices, they've gotten so much. It's already starting to go down on players. It's ridiculous, boys. But for that price, 8.6. That's his transferable version. Now, if you give me the choice of this or, well, the transfer or the SPC, I'd go for the transfer. Simple as that. Uh, SPC, if I give that a value for coins, I don't agree with the price. I'd probably give you 6.2. But I do, like, definitely take into consideration. You might have so much fodder in your club. You don't know what to do with it. If you want Van Persie, you get Van Persie, simple as that. But boys, that's why I'm going to love you and leave you for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, yeah, honestly, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos, man. Um, I try my best in every video. Sometimes it does get the best of me when I see not many people interact with the videos. Which, by the way, it, it, it's in a low point right now. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie, boys. Just looking through the videos now. But I mean, I'm doing what I love. Hopefully you guys appreciate that and uh, enjoy the videos for those that are watching. Yeah, simple as that. But uh, thank you very much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like on that. Get amongst the comments as well. And uh, subscribe. Notification bell. Set it to on. And uh, around the screen, there's a video there. There's a video there. So, sub button's there. But like that is disgraceful me saying that. Thank you very much for watching. Catch you in the next one.